Hi guys, welcome to Off the 10th. My name is Chris and today we're taking a look at something that's actually not a stout or porter. We're doing a different beer today. Today we are going to take a look at from Harpoon Brewing out of Boston, Massachusetts. It looks like uh, we're looking at the UFO Raspberry. Get in focus. There we go. All right, the UFO Raspberry is a delightfully sweet and slightly tart raspberry Hefeweizen. Hefeweizen. I love saying that word. It's a half. It's a raspberry half. It's coming in at 4.8% alcohol by volume. Uh, I picked this one up over at Wegmans. Mix six time. Yeah, I went over there a couple nights ago and decided to pick up this beer with a bunch of other beers too. Just to see what's going on in that mix six because... You know, that's the thing to do now is go to mix six packs. Right, Joe? All right, let's go. Let's take a look at the Raspberry UFO. All right. So right away, I thought it was going to be raspberry colored, but it's not. It's got a little bit of a, of a haze to it on the port. Unfiltered. I believe I did check online. This one is coming in at... 10 IBU, so this should be pretty easy to drink. All right, so it's coming off a lot darker than it really is. I kind of want to show you guys how light this really is. It's not, it's it's more yellow than, than the dark copper color that you're seeing on camera. But anyway, that's enough of that. It came off filtered, a little bit of condensation on this one. It is a little bit chilly on this one. I didn't, even, I didn't let this one really warm up. Uh, head on this one, small, small tight bubbles. Come on, there they are. There's the bubbles. Ah, uh, yeah, looks pretty good, that smell. Oh, that's just dominating my nose with raspberries right there. Uh, okay, I know it's got, I'm pretty sure it says on the can here that it's gonna be raspberry, artificial raspberry. Ooh, natural raspberry flavors added. Okay, I was wrong because this one smells like it's like these were fresh raspberries just pulled right out of Redbeard's backyard and just put into a beer. Wow, this smells pretty freaking awesome. Uh, other than that, I get a little bit of breadiness of the, from the half, but other than that, it's just being dominated by the raspberries. So you know what? I want to drink this. Cheers, guys. Let's take it back. Well, this is supposed to be tart. It's not really. It's actually a little bit sweeter than I thought it was going to be. As a raspberry tart half, you think it would be a little bit tart, even even might even try to be a little bit sour, but not really. No. Maybe maybe just a slight little bit of tartness right back here, but it goes away real fast. Turns a little bit sweet. But I'll tell you, this is freaking refreshing. I'll tell you that for sure. This is a very refreshing beer. It's almost cooler-like, I guess. It's a refreshing beer that's going down super easy. Uh, it's 4.8. It's supposed to be. No bitterness. It is a bit thin. Kind of, you know, well, it's 4.8. I'm not expecting it to be medium body or anything like that. It is a thin body on this one. Head's already gone. But you know what? It's, it's super... Easy to drink. I think I already said that. It's creamy. It's unfiltered. A little bit of that yeast is making it a little bit easier to, for a little bit bigger than a super watery mouthfeel, but it is pretty thin nonetheless. Anyway, guys, I'm dragging this one on. I kind of wanted to try to make this one a little bit shorter of a video, and I totally failed. But anyway, guys, let me know in the comments if you guys have had the UFO. That was a weird voice. The UFO raspberry from Harpoon. Let me know if you guys have had this. And if you have, let me know what you thought. I could totally drink a shitload of these. This is so easy to drink. It's almost, like I said, it's almost cooler like. And in the mix six pack, well, I paid a dollar or something for this all day, every day. I don't mind it. Go out there, try it, guys. Some people may not like this, but this is kind of my jam. I like it. All right, guys. Subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Like the video if you want. If not, whatever. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out, homies.